are back again today at Sugar Loaf. Um, look out, we are currently just um, parking. Um, the weather is nice today, so I want to come back here so I can do my drone uh, photography and videoing. Um, Sugarloaf is in, uh, I think, called Leon National Park. Anyway, while well, Justin was trying to take picture of the um, the Sugarloaf Rock, I just stand here and then I saw uh, a school of dolphins swimming really close to the shore. They are still right now. I can see it from here. And so I told Justin quickly um, send the drone to get a good. Um, footage of them oh my god there are so many of them it's like yes a school of them and it's just so good uh, so happy that uh, it's quite windy but yeah I think because we have a mini three so it's good enough to withstand the wind but yeah I'm so happy that we get to see the open again today <laughs> we have found the first corner, which is number two, without using the bridge. Well, what is here that is important? Ah, uh, another dead end. We need to find number three and four. So we need to three and four. Yeah, we we saw four, but we couldn't get to it. Yeah, maybe you have to do three first, then you do four. All right, so three. Well, we have to go back there to go get out anyway. Okay, we have found number four. <laughs> After like I don't know, getting stuck, walking around back and forward to number one and number two, trying to find a different um, entrance. And we have finally made it to number four. We can see number three. <laughs> and now let's see how we're gonna get to it. Oh yeah, and then. Okay, we have found number three. It wasn't as hard as we expected. And this will lead us to the center. And then I guess we can exit from there. But yeah, we did it. We found all the four corner without cheating, <laughs> without using the the bridge uh, even though we didn't do it in order we found number two first and then number one and then number four and then number three
thing on my bucket list is to come to Basilton um, to join the um, Basilton jetty. Um, I know that the sunset is not on the water, but I think the sunrise might be on the water. Anyway, um, we we came here um, for sunset. Uh, the cloud today is dramatic, but for some reason the sunset is not as dramatic as I expected So the lighting wasn't that great um, uh, So yeah, well, I want to um, Drawn here during daytime because the color of the water is so blue sunset um, Doesn't bring out the water, but yeah, we did have dramatic sky today, so uh, I guess that's a tick. Uh, I was hoping to come back here again maybe early in the morning um, to do another video and then uh, yeah before we're leaving Market River for good because we are heading south soon after we pick up Eden on Monday and we are pretty much done. Um, we are back uh, in Market River. We're staying at our resource um, in Dunsborough. We will stay here until um, we pick up Eden so we have not been doing much at all probably just bludging killing time um, but yeah I don't see Justin and the girls anywhere I think they say they're at the playground so anyways there are a few more point of interest that we are going to do probably tomorrow and Saturday because the weather will be good the weather has not been great so far since I don't know since forever <laughs> like November or October um, we every day it's just like way too windy to 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 go out a bit cold for swim um, yeah so Hopefully the weather will improve when we start traveling um, down south, further south and then heading toward to South Australia via the Nullarbor. I cannot wait because going through the Nullarbor is one of my, um, is one of my bucket list. I think we're going to take the Nullarbor slow because we're not in a rush um, and my biggest things the the biggest the top of on my list is to camp at the Bundaberg uh, Bundaclip 